I have my friend, good friend here, Matt Vandal. If you guys don't know who he is, he's been in other videos with me. No knob to zero, just to see what happened. He's a, a teacher uh, that has uh, worked with me, for me, for forever. Forever. Long right. time. Long time. And, uh, He's, he's not only a good friend, but he's one of my favorite guitar players. We're going to check out three products that I have been cool. gathering up all year from companies who say that they can either improve or fix uh, somebody with a hand problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is the Rocket Bar, okay? And as you can see, very, very involved. Um, and this is a product that I was very interested in finding out more about. Is saying, hey, for people who can't physically make chords anymore, yeah. tune the guitar in alternate tuning, and then essentially this is yeah, we, yeah, yeah. Okay, you okay. See, yeah. You see how this is kind of coming, yeah. coming yeah. to bear here. So, basic open tuning in D minor, D A D F A D, D yeah. minor. So essentially, that's what we're going to tune to. Do, okay. It lets you play it lets you play all minor and major chords in any key which allows playing the songs. I'll give it a I am shot. I'll trying. give it a shot. Here we go. Yeah. Here we go. On the middle finger, right? Yeah. And do they have it all the way down in your palm? Yeah. Kinda. So I'm thinking maybe that edge yeah. goes on the edge of the fretboard? Yeah, that's what yeah, there's a pink yep, yep. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, so, you tilt it. You tilt is that what you do? Yeah, you're tilting it. Oh well. Major? Minor. Okay, so essentially that's the capo. The arm is like the capo, but it has... Yeah, and then again, yeah, if you want the, the major chord, you take, it has these... I'm not sure yet what this way, but this one you just lean it up and it gives you the major third, which makes it uh, makes it well major. Right. And so that's just barred off right now, right? Or that's no? barred off with the tilt, which gives you the the major. Yep. And just to do minor is uh, no tilt. You just put it flat again, and then you tilt it. You apply pressure to the to the front of it. And they have House of the Rising Sun. Right. Right. So let's do that one. Let's see if we can do it. I yeah. would say this one of a, it does require more force than what I thought. It's a little bit of force. You have, you have to, to push squeeze a like bit. squeeze like you mean it. Yeah, because it is kind of a rubbery thing. So you kind of got to. I was definitely squeezing a good amount. So we're gonna do G, C, and D, right? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I got it. I, ago uh, when I was first started teaching at your shop uh, an old guy came in and uh, he couldn't do bar chords anymore so he he uh, he knew I taught though so he asked me hey I will pay you to work out where I can put a capo so I can play my songbook and not have any bar chords anymore so he had me transcribe the whole book and put them into where okay for this song put the capo here and then it'll avoid your bar chords and stuff so you know so it's the guys are still out there trying to play and this is stuff that's just trying to trying to help them do it but I think it's just super cool that companies are out there trying to keep us playing as, as long as possible so that's just kudos to them for for trying to figure stuff out and uh and yeah, it's super cool something else worth noting all three of these companies are essentially like obviously mom and pops but they're all small small companies are people they? out of their homes kind of basically wow. saying really? hey yeah. i have this idea and they created these these That's kits awesome yeah That's so it was really cool. cool i thought that was really a really interesting thing to do this is called wrist grips this is a compression wrap for musicians we're gonna go ahead and open it i want to thank the wrist grips guys for sending this out so it's gonna the buckle goes on your pinky side pinky your side wrist. gotcha 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 right and it says Loop the curved end of the wrist grip under your wrist and through the buckle. Under your wrist, through the buckle. 
Does uh, it say how tight to do it? Uh, it says, just... uh, okay, now it says pull the carved in so that the, the wrist grip feels snug, but not cutting off circulation. Yeah. And adjust so the edge of the wrist grip is against the base of your hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so I can definitely see. And then, of course, they want you then to turn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that the buckle is, I get it. So they don't the want directions the... were fine. That was, yeah. That was, the, well, that was me. And, <laughs> it's, and you could tell, I could tell why they don't want the buckle stabbing into your hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then I made it a little too snug. It, yeah. So, okay. So, uh, it says this could be worn 24 seven. It will prevent and reverse injury and pain. I don't like that statement. That doesn't seem like, a, I don't know how they can prove it reverses injury, but hey, you know, um, I don't, I'm skeptical. What can I say? Uh, so one size fits all, can be clean. Go ahead and I guess give it a play, right? like it's it's doing what it's supposed to do which i believe is keep the wrist straight yeah well, a lot of problems happen is is um either you, you wear the strap very low or of course all the 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 cool stretchy stuff that we do puts a lot with uh, the wrist like this which uh strains the tendons over the yeah. wrist and cause so this kind of keeps it from you know doing like just keep it straight from us doing stuff like this or whatever yeah that's the thing that feels like it would work and it doesn't feel like inhibiting i don't feel like oh i can't do what i want because it's like constricting me or whatever it feels right. it feels fine it's on their snug too this is the sips string instrument performance spacer okay so comes in a blue bag. That's a, kind of a weird packaging, so you can't see what's inside of it. It's a secret. It's like a secret bag. <laughs> right. Um, okay, so this one, it's got instructions as well, and I will, of course, screenshot this so you guys can see what I'm looking at, which is, uh, it's a color printout, right? Um, and again, I should also uh, say uh, thank you to the Sips guys for sending this out. More importantly, uh, just because it's important, uh, Sips guys asked if they, if I would be willing to do a video, right? And I said, yes, yeah, send it out. Um, and I asked them if they would be willing to do something cool. So Sips guitar to be in this video is buying one veteran with PTSD a guitar and lesson pack. So that's what so I asked cool. them to do. To, so they're cool. sponsoring the video by providing that Super service to somebody. Um, so thank them again for that and for sending the product for us to check out. It looks like your wrist goes to the black loop. And I don't, I think it's the, the tricky part is this is a spacer, right? I know it look, right, right, looking right. at this is the most crazy thing. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so I think wrap that over through your thumb, wrap the white part up like, Oh, okay, 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 okay. I think that's how we're doing that, All right? right? Kind of okay. Snug. Yep. Yeah. And then this thing, you're gonna, it's gonna make sense in a second, I think. Now, you see what it's kind of going for here? Oh. Yeah. It, so here's uh, with this kind of stuff, if you're just doing like. Position stuff where this is all kind of close, like this kind of grip that we do. Um, of course, it's it actually works pretty good. It just kind of glides along and it gives a little space. Feels kind of supportive. Any of the the more kind of like classical stuff, it, as you can see, it kind of it, it goes away. Oh, it does it, yeah. yeah, yeah. If you put your hand out at all, which that maybe what they're trying to do, because again, this can cause the issues of being extended like this, and right? Problems, or the, to where this kind of forces you to kind of guide along and and avoid doing that kind of straining oh, okay. kind of movement. There, there's no muscles in the fingers. Right. Yeah. Right. There's. Yeah. Yeah. So all the stuff is pulling back over here and stuff. I mean, we can damage the fingers too, but but definitely all this. There's, there's a lot going on in there. So yeah, we want to be. But yeah, yeah. It's very interesting. It's this one is a little bit more. Um, it would take a little bit more getting used to. Right. Um, the other one was kind of you know the hand was free and it just the wrist felt a little tight. But this uh, I can see this. And someone could try this out and and, um, and it'll leave you. It's and the. The best advice I got w was in college. I had a little bit of tendonitis in my middle finger. Um, it was classical guitar, and um, the practice rooms were really cold. But my professor said he had a little problem too, you know, through the years. What he said, do whatever feels good. 
like if hot works good or heat then cold works good or resting or wearing a glove when you sleep if that works whatever so definitely you know if something like this you know it works and <laughs> stick with it so this also like reinforces uh this kind of like this angle where the fingers go right. off and that our hand naturally wants to do this kind of a thing where they call it a pinky roll where the pinky wants to come on and that's how we can like grab things and right. tools when we were cavemen and we could build stuff because it, it, um i believe primates they can't do that it's, it's more like this so right. our hand naturally wants to do this kind of pinky roll and this thing makes your hand that's about the only way you can play is with that and you can see my fingers as soon as i go like this the the device is off and not engaged right. anymore yeah so, so that's that's watching you that's uh, one of the things i was interested in was is it forces you to stay mm. in a certain position you know what I mean? it is. yeah 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 because uh, this is pretty taxing on the hand and this is just more relaxed natural kind of like like way that's interesting so it could be a good guy for a beginner too yeah 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 I can't right. tell you any one of these products would solve your problem, but I can tell you that none of these products were a sham. None of them were no, no, not no, doing no. what they say. They all no, did no. what they said. Whether or not it helps you or not, that's up to yeah, individual yeah, users, but yeah, they all yeah. seem to do what they claimed, which is important. It um, is. If, if it feels good, then, then it's working. You know, that it helps. I agree. On that note, I'm going to thank you guys so much for your time. Until next time, know your gear.